WCH 12 Eyewitness News. Coverage you can count on. The theory of adjusting the clock to save energy dates back to Benjamin Franklin. Now Congress is looking to extend daylight saving time. Last night, House and Senate negotiators worked late on the bill. If it passes, daylight savings would be a month longer. Eyewitness News reporter Clinton Griffiths spent the day talking to Kansans about changing time. Never seem to have enough. If you're talking time, Nathan Childs would be an expert. I tend to be late usually for some reason. I don't know. It's kind of a uh, ironic thing. Management is another story. While daylight savings means more work, he wouldn't mind the extra month. It'd be nice to, to have a little bit more uh, daytime. Um, you know, whether it's worth it to, to mess up everybody's schedule or not, I don't know. While supporters say more daylight means saving money on energy bills, not everyone's in favor. Airlines say they'll lose millions in scheduling conflicts around the world. Schools across the country are afraid sending kids to class in the dark will be more dangerous. I don't like it. I'd like to see it one way and leave it that way. Don't change it back and forth, whichever way you move it, but leave it. <laughs> With plenty of time for time discussions, this group isn't in favor of any changes, now or ever. I don't see how it can save money by changing it. Now, I'm not that smart, but maybe it will, but I don't see it. So whether it's spring forward, fall back, or wait another month, Time is one thing everyone is trying to stretch. In Wichita, Clinton Griffiths, KWCH 12 Eyewitness News. Congress hopes to have the daylight saving bill put together today. It's part of an energy bill that will eventually have to be approved by the president. We also wanted to know what you think. That's what our exclusive Fact Finder 12 scientific survey asked 500 Kansans. Here are the results. They're equal. 45% think extending daylight saving time is a good idea. 46% think it's a bad idea. Of those who don't like the plan, most say it's because they worry darker mornings will be a danger to kids walking to school. Will clouds darken your day anytime soon? Merrill's back with your forecast.